All right, welcome, Mike Simmons here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the background color of your navigation menu in the WordPress 2012 theme. We've actually moved the navigation menu below the header in an earlier video. Now we're going to change the background color of the navigation menu and also center the font and change the font color of the navigation menu. And we're going to utilize a, a add-on for Firefox called Firebug, which allows you to see the CSS code of certain elements that you would like to change and put in your child theme, which I should mention it's a really good idea if you're going to do any of these changes like this to get a child theme for your WordPress 2012 theme, just because it'll save you a little bit of time and effort if you do make these changes and put them in your parent theme then you might lose them all when the WordPress updates its themes which it does. Making a child theme is real simple so just look for that video. I'll put a link and an annotation right in this video here so you can click on it and go watch the child theme video and make a child theme first. And I'm also going to use a tool called Firebug which is an add-on for Firefox. I also have a video in my channel for that so I'll put an annotation to a link to that video too. So what we're going to do is we're going to utilize Firebug and we're going to identify first the elements we need to change for the background color and the centering the font of the navigation menu. So I'll just go ahead and right click and inspect element with Firebug. Now you'll notice right here there's a bunch of CSS code. You don't have to know CSS code to use this. So first of all I am going to Right here where it says text align, I'm going to type in center. Now you notice it's centered. And then I'm going to click right click and then click on new property and I'm going to put in background and then colon. And I'm going to put a color, which I'm actually going to use something else from Firefox add on called colorzilla to identify the color that I'd like to get. I'll just hover my mouse over this and click and it'll be copied into my clipboard. And I'll go back and click on new property again after right clicking and type in background. And I'm going to show you all this code. Uh, in fact, put it on my site so you can copy all this code if you like and change the colors and the whatever else to your liking. But I'm going to paste in that color code right there. Now you notice right here all the uh, color and the is changed for the navigation menu. But now we can't see the font very well, so we want to change that color too. So I'm going to right click in here with Firebug. And now we have this color right here. We're just going to make this white. Okay, so there we go. One more thing. The current menu item, which is the home menu, is it's kind of hard to see too. So we're going to change that one also. I'm going to right click with Firebug and now it says main navigation all this code right here I'm going to change that to just uh, dark black and there we go that's how you do it I'm going to put all this code in a in a child theme file on my site so you can just copy all the different codes that you like I'll identify all the codes in my child theme so it'll look something just like this and there'll be a little a line above this which will say which code changes which. So if you'd like to copy that child theme and the code and then put it in your own child theme style.css and then change the colors and whatever to your liking, you're more than happy to do so. Just click the link in my video description. And you'll be taken to the site and you can copy and paste that code in. If you do find this helpful, please give it a thumbs up and a favorite and subscribe to my channel. Hopefully this was easy enough for you to follow. You'll probably have to watch some of these other videos to actually uh, maybe understand what I'm doing in this one, but I put all the links in the videos for you to click on. So please subscribe and I keep on adding more videos to my channel. And as always, keep on keeping on.